who played around with the push-ups on Wednesday? Good. Oh, let me try. You haven't gotten your friend. Come over. How many did you do Wednesday? Uh, 43. Oh, jeez. Go face up. <laughs> 43? Jeez. It, the, I got to cut some slack for this one. 43. So if I had the patient. 43, I'm damn well stimulated. <laughs> okay, so it's like, I breathe in. And out. And in. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Out. How long does it last? Do I have to start doing my push right now? Breathe in. What's that? How long does this last? Do I have to start doing my push-ups right now? No, I, I don't. And uh, I think it lasts about half an hour, but I do it. That's just me. Like, I'll do it. Yeah, I'm going to do it right now. Let's see. I mean, 43. We need 86. 86. Yeah, all right. We'll see. Breathe in. Deep breath in. Hold it. I feel like I'm just standing uh, strong. It, you're gonna feel better. You know what, is what got me? I mean, it changed aldosterone levels oh, yeah. in 1979. I feel much different. Yeah, I'm telling you, it works. It's not hokey, but you got to be specific. You know what I mean? That looks good. <laughs> so, if rubbing just between T11, T12 changed aldosterone levels, demonstrable, <laughs> measured, changed blood pressure. Don't tell me if we don't treat the adrenal, the whole. Axis, the hypothalamic, pituitary, adrenal, gonadal axis. Deep breath in. And out. And the pituitary sensitive center one? Yes. Which structure are you? Always going, right hand rule in. I call it, it's clockwise if I look at you. Okay. Always think the right hand rule, thumb going in, on the right and the midline. It's almost like you're bringing energy into your body. Take a deep breath in. All right, hold it. And out. Okay, let's see what you got. All right, it's the opposite way. You better give us at least 50. Oh, but it's going in. It's still right hand rule, though. Where it's going in. So that's why, yeah, I never thought of wording it the other way, but uh, who's counting for him? Close to the mental barrier now. What do we got? Now we go. 43. Still going. All right, I'm going out and doing mine. Let's see what you got. Okay. 53. All right. And you really tried 43 the other day? Yeah, same way the failure. Yeah. Okay, all right. Well, I'm 43. <laughs> All right, so 43 to 53, and he, I'm glad you tried to jump, but it's... <laughs> but I feel a difference. I mean, it was sort of like a bit unconscious until like 35, 40. It wasn't even really... And all of a sudden, the fatigue started hitting, so... Okay, good. Big, big difference, yeah. All right, you, you know your body. Oh, yeah, totally. Yeah. All right, good. So that's, that's a great that's a great <laughs> testimony of that idea. Because uh, I remember you with your bike. I know you're a good athlete. Yeah, yeah, totally. Sure. So, and that is what happens. I'll do that, too. I go, oh, I'm just tired. To, I'm just going to do 30. I could do three more. You had your day. Let me do three more. Oh wait. Oh okay. Five. Oh, I did like seventeen more. Wow. How'd you do? Thirty-five to forty-eight. Oh wait. Oh, you went. I, I, Thirty-five was three days ago. I just did forty-eight. Forty-eight. Right. 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 My shoulder was killing me because I didn't want to do them, but I just had to try. <laughs> And you now it's not he, the right thing too. No, I know that's true. And with an AC joint problem. Yeah, I know. But I had to do, well, it was the same problem I had. So, so well, how would you describe it? Because he described like he would normally get a fatigue level and it wasn't there at that yeah, point. Yeah, it was late. Yeah. How about you, Joe? Yeah. Well, I did. I was doing knuckles because I had a wrist injury. I did 31 Wednesday. And I just did 54. 54. All right. I so, probably could have pushed it then. All right, so you went from 30, what? 31. To 54. 54. All right. 43 to 53. And where'd you go to? 35 to 48. All right. So what do you think, Docs? What do you think of the technique? A success? Yeah. Success. 
All right, good. That's what I like to hear.